All right, Warriors, welcome back to the school circle. I'm about to cook my dinner. Um, so I've been doing the, uh, the keto diet or the low carb ketosis diet for about a week and a half now. I feel amazing. Uh, my energy levels are up. Um, I'm not even really in full ketosis yet. Um, you know, still going through, through the process of keto adapting. Um, you know, I'm also doing an intermittent fast. So most of my, my calories are at the end of the day, you know, I eat um, basically one, one big meal um, where I get most of my nutrients uh, and I'm about to cook what's been my favorite. Um, I got a steak pinwheel here. Um, it's a skirt steak that um, is stretched out in a strip, has a little bit of provolone cheese on it, a little bit of spinach, and it's all wrapped up and tied together. So um, got my pan hot, my oven preheated, um, I don't have my uh, garlic infused olive oil, so I'm just going to use a little bit of this olive oil. Got the pan heated up just to a little bit above smoking. That's probably a little bit hot. And then I'm going to slap this puppy down. I'm going to go ahead and sear it for two minutes. on each side. All right guys, so I got both sides seared, um, two minutes each side, about medium high heat on the pan. Got my oven preheated to 375. We're gonna go ahead and stick this in the oven. We're gonna set the timer for 10 minutes and let that thing cook. All right guys, so we're done baking. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this out of the oven. Nice and juicy. Got myself some green beans. You know, balance this out, this meal out. Dive in here. All right. So there you have it. There's my skirt steak pinwheel and my roasted green beans. All right, so next time, uh, hopefully next week, I'll be doing my first attempt at cooking liver um, and also doing a bone broth. So um, I'll be talking more uh, next week about you know the nutrients and the benefits of, of you know that that meal and uh, try out how how it tastes and how good I am at cooking liver.